Welcome back to Horizon Bound. My name is Ed. We are talking a little bit about our next trial run. So the previous trial run ended when the batteries got out of balance and shut the power down for the system. We are currently in day two of the trial run. Uh, started yesterday with cooking dinner and worked all day from the camper uh, with the new power system. We are currently at uh, 83% and I will, oh, I guess 80 something. Hang on, double check in here. Yep, 83, 83%. And uh, I will throw up a screenshot here. Um, the question becomes, how far down will the system go before it shuts down? Because the batteries were out of uh, were out of balance previously. We ended up with one battery at nine volts and the other one at twelve and a half volts. The twelve and a half volt battery could have gone a little bit farther before it shut down. The nine volt battery, not so much. That's why when it dropped below twenty four volts, the whole system shut down. So we've converted over to a complete Victron system, which you'll see in a previous video. Uh, a running twelve volt, and we've been running off of solar and battery for realistically three days but i've only really put a serious load on it for the last 48 hours so tonight uh will be the second night i'm sleeping in the camper do a star trek shirt tug um tonight will be the second night i'm sleeping in the camper why is that a big deal? Well, because I use a CPAP machine. The CPAP machine does require some power in order to heat the, the humidifier and to run the, the pump. So, realistically and honestly, that is the entire reason I've built this camper. So that I can get somewhere off-grid and still have my health needs met. Um, if I could, if I was the kind of person who could pitch a tent and sleep uh, on the side of the road, I would have never built any of this. But this is where I am, and this is how I want it, and how I need to be. So, tonight is the big experiment. I'm at, I'm at 83%, and we'll see where this whole thing goes in the next eight hours. See you tomorrow. <clears throat> All right. Good morning. It's the following morning. Uh, approximately 6.45. I've been up for about 45 minutes. Given the system time to uh, stabilize. And uh, I can say right now I'm feeling pretty good about the performance. I'm still uh, above 75%. I think I might have dropped, just dropped down to 75. I've got the lights on. I don't need them on because it's dawn outside and I'm facing the sun. I'm already starting to pull a little bit of power, but I'm not going to get a whole lot because I am underneath the tree again because we're back inside the yard. Um, but based on the performance from the last couple of days, I think it's uh, I think it's safe to say I need to move forward, um, get the Starlink mounted, get the solar panels finalized because I have some cabling up there I want to tape down and I want flopping around while I'm going down the freeway. And start on the plumbing. The plumbing is, is the next big push. Uh, I've got a lot of little things. Um, the back corner uh, behind me, I still don't have a, a real plan for that. I did at one point, and those plans have changed. I didn't like those plans. So it's all storage, and yeah, I think the new power system is going to be a win. Talk to you soon. This was a triumph I'm making a note here Huge success It's hard to overstate my satisfaction